Stare so deep in your eyes I touch on you more and more every time When you leave, I'm begging you not to go Call your name two, three times in a row Such a funny thing for me to try to explain How I'm feeling in my pride is the one to blame Cause I know I don't understand Just how your love can do a no one's head Got me looking so crazy 
These mics, yeah, these mics are going. All right. Okay. So, uh, hi, <laughs> Welcome. Leslie. We're, we're moving the camera around, so everybody give us a minute. Yeah. Um, Hello, everyone. Greetings from our new spot at the Chattanooga Public Library for Music Wednesday. woo -hoo. Yeah. Yeah. You guys were just listening to Amber Carrington and Dran Lewis. Beautiful. Pretty beautiful. Amazing. And this studio sounds so crystal clear, and it's just amazing that it's here at the the public library on Broad. You guys should come check it out. Uh, recently open, right, Meredith? Yeah, uh, July 1, we officially opened. Awesome. So let's tell everybody a little bit about the yeah. vision behind this, and then we can talk about our partnership and yeah. the Girls Rock and all the cool stuff There's going a on. lot. There are a lot of things happening in this four rooms right <laughs> now, so we're going to try to get to all that very quickly. Yeah. We wanted to uh, open with two songs because it is a music show, so it thank is. you to Amber and Duran, but uh, let's talk about why we're here and introduce everybody. I'll go around the room. Meredith Levine is the director of the studio here at the Public Library, is <laughs> that right? The youth director. It's okay. Head of Youth okay. Services, uh, manager of the studio, and manager of the fourth floor. We got a lot of good spaces here at the library. It's a big building. And the guy behind her without the microphone, because he's a drummer, <laughs> we don't, don't, don't get microphones. Don't get microphones. No. Sorry. <laughs> Johnny Smith uh, with uh, so many hats. Yes. With everything. Yeah. Help put this together and, uh, and help get Amber and Dran here. So thanks, Johnny, for everything. Amelia Rogers-Jones, uh, Chattanooga Girls Rock. Uh, their camp is this week. Coincidentally, there's about 10 girls here helping. We'll have them here on camera if you can't see. Uh, they've been helping set up. They're learning the studio, and they're learning it from Kessler Kaufman, who is hey. with Dynamo Studios. So that's everybody that's here. Um, I guess let's start with you. Tell us about the studio. Yeah, it, it, it opened July. Yeah. What's it for? Wh 
So it is for everybody in Chattanooga. Uh, so the library, I mean, why the library is a perfect place for something like this is the library is about access. Um, and not everybody has access to a professional studio like this um, and for free. Um, so the only thing you need to get into this space is a library card. Um, so, you know, we have our fourth floor maker space where you have 3D printer, laser cutter, a vinyl plotter. Um, so you have access to that. And then you also have access to a space like this. Um, so, you know, our, our crew actually on staff were the ones who did the the hard work building it. Um, James Madchek was our studio designer um, and his team, Phil, ben Phil Benjamin, Michael Miller, um, and Kevin, uh, they did a great job um, keeping education in mind. So when we built this studio, we wanted to make sure it was an educational facility. Um, so people can come in and that's where our partnership with Kessler and Dynamo Studios, where they can come in with the experts. They'll teach people how to actually use the equipment that's in here. And then our goal, you'll see this in a couple months, um, we'll actually have open studio time. So with your library card, you'll be able to book two to four hour blocks after you've gone through assessment. We know that you know how to use everything. You'll be able to come in here and record a track. That's pretty cool. And I was just looking at all of your comments. Uh, we're able to, for these fun little devices, there's so much technology in here, but everybody's saying, uh, Amber and Dran, that it sounded great, and they loved it, and all positive comments. So that's really cool. So that's why all the thumbs ups I'm giving you guys back. Yeah. yeah. So people are excited today, Music Wednesday. And behind the camera, you guys can't see it, but there's a bunch of girls. There's Can a bunch of girls. Hi? Girls Scream, rock. Hi, something. Oh, girls louder. rock. <laughs> Yeah, you guys. Right. You want to come in? Some of yeah, you. Yeah, come hi. say hi. Don't knock. Yeah, we're all over. about girls rocking up in here. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. Yeah, this is the <laughs> engineering and production group. So yes. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Amelia, are you back there? Can you be? Can hi. you be seen? <laughs> all right. So. Amelia. Yeah. Tell hi. us about hi. this is one of the coolest <laughs> things in Chattanooga, I think. So totally. it's two years old. Thanks. Kudos for you for bringing yeah, it here. Yeah, it's our second year. We're in the middle of our second um, one-week camp. Um, yeah, we're a nonprofit music education and performance camp for girls ages 10 to 17 here in town. Um, empowerment is also a really big part of our mission. So um, while music is the vehicle it isn't the only focus but um music is perfect for that because it's a reflection of the world we live in and it influences the world that we live in so totally. um it's just a really good time <laughs> we are just hanging out we're all exhausted and um <laughs> classic yeah just doing it what's your name finley it's a cool name how old are you 10 so how long have you been a part of the girls rock camp this is my second year what do you think it's really fun really fun what has it taught you um just a little bit last year it taught me how to play the guitar and this year i'm on vocals very cool do you feel stronger yeah <laughs> yeah yeah are, you, are cool. you empowered do you feel empowered <laughs> do you have a roar like Katy perry a little bit yeah, yeah. i actually sang roar today you did yeah. <laughs> awesome yeah. good cool. choice very cool so the 10 girls that are here are learning engineering, drumming, setups, all this from Kessler. And then there's 40 more at the auditorium, right, or that are learning Close guitar, bass, or so. Yeah, so this is um, one of our workshop tracks. We have five of them. So when they're not in instrument instruction class or in band practice, they're in workshops. And this is one of the five that we do, sound engineering and recording. The other ones are DIY, um, finding your voice, which is a lot of writing, poetry, songwriting, a uh, little bit of vocal coaching there, too. Um, embodying power, which involves self-defense and um, a talk about healthy relationships and some yoga and mindfulness. So it's a pretty well-rounded um, program. Like I said, it's not just about the music, although the music is, you know, the most fun. <laughs> <laughs> um, the music is the most fun, honestly. Yeah, it's the most fun. Yeah. Why don't you guys all introduce yourselves since you're here? Okay, what's your name? My name is Anna. Anna? Ariel. Ariel. Amaya. Amaya. Zari. Morgan. Morgan. Emma. Emma. Thank you guys. Girls rock. So, Kessler, you've been teaching these girls. I've watched uh, a couple hours worth. What What is the lesson that you want to teach them, and how does having a space like this, because this fits with the mission of your yeah. business. We should say that first, right? Yeah, so my organization, Dynamo, we partnered with the library a long time ago with, you know, this kind of grand thing in mind and what it would end up becoming. And the the foundation of every bit of it is just the students and empowering like that next generation and trying to 
bridge that gap between the current music economy and hopefully the people that will be growing up to fill the next big music you know industry in the city and uh, giving them anything and everything they could ever need to really capitalize on their already you know you know just natural talents and give them what they need to make those other steps to start moving into working in studios with labels management companies music venues you know we've talked with songbirds revelry room track 29 all these other venues in the cities about getting students plugged in there they learn the professional skills here and then we help them get an opportunity beyond the learning environment to actually you know take full ownership of their success so what we're doing with the girls this week is we are taking them through every single step of the music production process in a studio environment so you know learning the gear learning like how acoustics in a room work so not an acoustic guitar but like the treatments and the sonic like you know science behind each room and why each room sounds different how you use the equipment how you use it in different ways and today is really the first time they've gotten to straight up you know just apply those skills and record to you know very talented professional musician so everything you guys heard in that live performance that was all um you know the students set all of that up so that's that's a pro level good job recording pro level mix and they did pretty much all of it with what they learned yesterday so this is you know this is what it's all about and this is kind of like the pinnacle of that so um the rest of the week we're going to spend um tomorrow well i guess tomorrow is the last day for this um for their class and we've had them for four days Tomorrow we're going to have them in here and we'll be recording some of them and they'll be, get to you know, work with each other and stuff like that. And it'll kind of be something where we kind of step back and jump in if they get stuck. So they are going to take absolute ownership of running the studio more or less tomorrow. It's going to be it's going to be really fun. Very so. cool. You guys excited? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So uh, piggyback on the back of that, uh, we're excited because uh -huh. this is going to be our new home. This is Sweet. Music Wednesdays every Thank week you. unless we go out. And it's for a lot of reasons. One, it sounds great. Um, <laughs> it's a beautiful space. It but was. a lot of what you were just saying, that same, and that same mission, everything seems to fit. We want to be a part of the same things. Uh, we, we hope to have uh, young people involved helping every week. Uh, we hope to have local musicians, as we always have, maybe some touring musicians to come in that maybe want to work with the kids. Mm -hmm. um, so we're just very, very excited about this opportunity very in grateful. this space. So, mm -hmm. um, Yay! Did we mention Saturday? Saturday. Oh, yeah. What's up? Saturday. Saturday's the big day. Big so day. So <laughs> during camp week, these girls form <laughs> bands. They awesome. write an original song together. So we have 10 bands, so 10 original songs. And <laughs> paper towel. Um, <laughs> on Saturday at 1 p.m., they're going to play a big show at the Revelry Room. Ooh. Yeah, it's our showcase concert. Um, we love it if, if you could all come and support. Yeah. It's open to the public. Last year, it was pretty packed out. It was super awesome. fun. Um, the environment was uh, just really electric and exciting and they so had a great cool. time too so how do people get information about the camp i know mm -hmm. it's going on right now and about this saturday at the revelry room sure so frankly we update our facebook more than we do our website um we do we do website. too <laughs> not really <laughs> we have a website it looks great actually kessler helped us build it and it's beautiful oh but we're a little quicker um with the, with Facebook. So if you just search Chattanooga Girls Rock. Okay. Um, Chattanooga Girls Rock. You can you get guys. info there. And you can buy tickets. CGR. Or CGR. CGR. And you can buy tickets to the Showcase concert at the Revelry Room website. Okay. Or um, just at the box office whenever it's open. And we recommend getting them in advance. The line was pretty long last year. And you don't want to miss any of it. So. I think it's the Revelry, Revelry Room dot co, But I'll link you guys. Yeah. 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 Sounds right. Yeah. The Revelry Room. It's hard. <laughs> I know. Yeah. All right. Um, did we miss anything from any of you guys? Um, you know, great. just uh, keep an eye out for more programs in the fall. We've got a lot of things cooking with the library and stuff. You know, right now the focus is all the students for the summer because they're out of school. Um, this fall we will start opening. I mean, we've had a lot of people reach out about this, but we'll start having programs for, you know, adult learners 18 and up. Um, anything and everything you could really imagine in the studio, we're going to be covering it. So, you know, be on the lookout for that. If there's something specific that you really want to learn or, you know, have an idea for a program, 
reach out to Meredith if you have questions about programming and anything like that. You know, we can answer questions for you. And, uh, you know, this is for Chattanooga, and we want Chattanooga to take advantage of that and use these resources. And, you know, we want to put, put Chat on the map for music and make some big things happen. But we, we have everything here now, so it's up to you guys if you want yeah. it. Come and get it. <laughs> what is it? If you, if you build it, they yeah, will come? Well, hopefully, yeah. <laughs> um, if you want uh, more info on everything, all the equipment that we have on here, um, you just go to our website. So it's chatlibrary.org slash the studio. Um, and so all of the classes, if you're interested um, in the classes that Dynamo is leading here, um, you sign up through our website. So that's just chatlibrary.org slash events. Follow us on Facebook, all that stuff yeah. we're, we're we'll, all over we'll the internet too. Guys. Um, so <laughs> and yeah i mean just reach out to us if you have an idea if you want to partner with us um a, lo- a big part of our focus is just getting our teens really engaged yeah. so um yeah. you're going to see a lot of teens in here and they're going to be really inspired and and hopefully you know go out and make music and, and participate i'm glad you brought that up because i know you probably going to get inundated this, this is not a place for professionals to come and record a live or full album right now it's yeah. going to take you a really long time yeah. to do that if you want to That's not to what do this that. is about. It's the education and right now the young people. So I wanted to emphasize that. And I think we're going to go out, I hope, with Dran and Amber if they're going to play another one, if we can get them. Unless they <laughs> left. Did they leave? No, they're still here. They're can we, there. Can we right, twist can get your them arms? Set up and uh, okay. we'll move the camera again, I guess. Yeah, so we'll while walk we're you talking into a little bit. the studio, yeah. right? So you're well, going to go Thank ahead. you, guys. Okay. Thank room. you. So... Okay. 